What's up guys, this is Val Camera from Dream Lights. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can create gorgeous female renders using a special Super HDRI map for iRay. Now, the most common issue when you do outdoor renders with female, female you know, characters is that the HDR map doesn't provide sufficient lighting. As you can see here, and by no means I'm discrediting Dimension Theory or any other vendor creating uh, awesome, you know, HDR maps. It's just they are not made for character renders off the bat. Usually you have, as you can see, they cast some cool lighting in shadows, but they look very dark in the shadows. They do not bring out the detail in the face. They do not bring out the female beauty. Now. And regardless what, what kind of type of map you add, you always end up with the same, you know, similar issues. Lighting comes at a an awkward, you know, angle. Uh, character doesn't look uh, illuminated from all, you know, sides. We lack uh, details in the shadows, and you can just continue and add map after map. And unfortunately, it will not get better because all these maps are pretty much the same. They have a very strong sunlight and the shadows are darker. They do not bring out uh, the female beauty in the way you, you know, expect them to do. So what I've done is I've created a super HDR map for Array. Let me just show you how powerful it is because what it does, it creates special lighting all over the image and adds beautiful lighting, character lighting uh, from multiple directions. It adds key light, field lights, bounce light, uh, environmental or all over lighting, back lighting, all included all at once. As you can see, with just a single click, you add all of those at once. The background is illuminated. The character is fully, you know, visible. Uh, the shadows are not that dark, so you can bring out the details in her face, her eyes, and her body. So this is just how powerful and instant this is. Now let me show you another example. So again, here we have a standard HDR map with sunlight uh, coming at an angle and there as you can see there is a lot of shade a lot of dark shadows that don't you know they just do not bring out the details in the face in the way you would uh, need to to make these female renders look beautiful um, obviously, you can go ahead and, you know, rotate these around, but it just doesn't provide that kind of lighting you, you need to, to, to get these female renders to look more uh, soft. So again, let's just quickly switch over to the Super HD RI map, um, quickly here, Super HD RI map, and you can see immediately that it adds beautiful soft lighting all over around the model. This is made for outdoor lighting, guys. So this is not an interior. However, you can still make interior renders if you like to. But you can see it's very, very soft and it gently illuminates the face with fillers and bounce light that captures the eyes, eye reflections and all that. So it just looks stunning uh, each and every time. All right, so let's put her in an additional environment. I'm gonna show you one more, um, one more example. Here, I just wanted to quickly show you that is this light set is indeed uh, made for close-ups, right? It, it's made for bringing beauty in close-ups, but its strength, it's not only providing gorgeous lighting for the ladies, but also on the environment at the same time. So let's, let's, let me show you another example here. And again, just to be clear, I'm not discrediting these beautiful HDR maps, but they are not made for character lighting. 
that will work you know in outdoor settings and provide that kind of lighting but for couch lighting there is just nothing else uh, to be found that at the same time not only provides gorgeous looking lighting on the model but the environment at the same time so I carefully designed this to as you can see uh, remove the darkness in the image bring out all the details make the background look interesting as well as the foreground so let me just quickly now go through uh, Dreamlight Array Super HDRI and just add these beautiful lights uh, in an instant now upon loading as you can see there is a lot of stuff going on there was key lights fill lights balance lights background lights <laughs> you know uh, additional overall lighting and it all is capturing you know the beautiful uh, essence of the female model as well as the environment now once you have this loaded you have several options to choose from obviously you can go around and rotate the entire um, you know, dome to experiment with different angles from which direction is the sunlight coming from which direction is the the back um, lighting coming right so you can fine-tune this and rotate them to get the desired effect and no matter how you choose the camera you know the dough it will always provide some kind of spectacular lighting because that's the way it's designed it has multiple light sources embedded so it always you know provides lighting from multiple directions it just makes your render look, look more interesting without sacrificing some kind of depth and still mystery around uh, your render this is live interactive guys there's no magic here this is how it looks like when you use this light set this HDR map there is no additional lights whatsoever As you can see I have no additional lights in the scene just an HDR map and that's it so further on there are several um, different maps to choose from uh, you've got maps that have everything included like all the lights at the same time you've got some special versions with just the fillers and backlights or just the key and back or you know multiple options to, to let you play with this there are more moody versions included but they all have this in common that they illuminate everything from multiple with multiple light sources so regardless if you're getting if you're after that little bit darker uh, mood you will still get additional fillers or, or bounce light included so that your model doesn't look pitch dark in the shadows and here is yet another version with no sunlight included but three fillers that surround the model and provide additional lighting and all these are work uh, are created to work for outdoor environments so this is not this particular scene here it has some walls stripped down to you know let the lighting in but this is an, an outdoor environment okay all right so let me show you one more example here um, let's go to a, an Asian setting all right so again here we have an example with a normal HDR map and again the, the issue we are seeing is very very dark shadows uh, awkward you know sunlight angle that might look good on the environment but does not provide uh, you know female lighting that is uh, gorgeous looking so and it doesn't matter what kind of you know type you choose here it's always going to be the same there's always going to be that missing element because normal HDR maps don't have that embedded within them all right so again let's let's just choose quickly here go to dreamlight iray super hdr uh, map and let's just add that to the render immediately you can see that the, the whole scene is illuminated with multi from multiple angles uh, we got backlighting front lighting fillers bounce overall in gorgeous mix that just makes the render look interesting not only the character with beautiful soft lighting but also the entire environment looks interesting and obviously like i said you've got additional options you can indeed go around and rotate the entire thing you can rotate it 
you can change the angle at which it attacks your sheen to make it look different. Whatever you choose, um, there is always going to be interesting light, interesting shadows, and you can uh, adjust here on the uh, film ISO as well how strongly you want that to project. So as you can see, besides the normal lighting, you have backlighting included, right? So it always makes your render look special. Um, so, so like I said, we can continue and just rotate it here to a different angle. Let me just show you how versatile you can get by playing in different, you know, different angles, and just get creative, you know, whatever. Each scene is unique. What kind of angle we create those magical shadows for you? This is frankly the only thing I go, you know, and adjust here is the, the dome rotation. That's all you need. And on top of that, you can obviously play with the different, you know, um, settings here and choose them to your liking. Guys, this is it. Um, Grab this now during this special offer and go ahead start producing amazing looking premium renders right now. I'll see you next time.